Another night of crime alerts in the same neighborhood, and in one case, a man is shot. Anita Padilla is tracking an increase in violent robberies for us this morning. Good morning, Anita. Good morning, Sylvia. You know, these attacks are just crazy. So you're somebody just walking on the street, a car pulls up, people jump out, and you are ambushed. I mean, basically, that is what we're talking about here. What we understand is that around 1.22 in the morning, the men jump out of a white Kia. They're armed with guns. The vec victim never sees it coming, and clearly, they are surprised. Let's look at the video right now when they are robbed. Now, around 135, it was a 24-year-old shot less than two miles away, and he reports that gunfire came from a Kia. So what's going on here is for weeks, we have seen a surge in these overnight robberies. In fact, this week alone, there were more than a dozen of these cases with a concentration in the northwest and the west side of the city. One night, there were actually four armed robberies in the same night, all taking place within a 15-minute span. And in each case, they all had a similar MO, three to four armed suspects jumping out of a dark gray sedan demanding the victims wallets purses cell phones so chicago police say the robbery crime rates are up if you want to know how much it's a big number a whopping 107 percent in just seven days and the neighborhoods we're talking about here, because you're probably wondering where specifically is this happening, we're talking about mostly the Ukrainian Village, Lincoln Park, Lakeview, Hermosa, Jefferson Park. All of these neighborhoods is where if you live there, you need to be aware, especially if you're somebody walking, you don't expect something like this to happen. So what CPD is doing is they're putting more officers on the street. We're talking about the West Loop, West Town, Pilsen. They're gonna be doing this over the next three months. And what they're hoping is is that they're able to combat this problem. In fact, there's an alderman in that ward there, 36th Ward, who says that next week they're going to hold a meeting so that the community can come together, maybe discuss some of these concerns, talk about similarities. Sometimes you get information at these uh, meetings where you're, you know, not aware of, and that helps police too. That meeting, in case you want to attend, it is set for Tuesday at 6 o'clock at the Ukrainian Village Cultural Center. Sylvia? All right.